Hello guys, how's it going? Welcome to this brand new video on the Aryan Games channel. Today I'm going to be discussing a very small piece of code that can be very, very, very important to your game. I like how I got closer to the mic there. Now this piece of code is the draw underscore self, as you could probably tell from the title. And it is extremely, 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 extremely important. And I will show you why. So the draw underscore self is a piece of code you will use in the draw event so we're going to add an event and add a draw event and we're also going to go to control and drag in some code and you usually will use it at the beginning of your code right at the top you're going to use draw underscore self now at the moment all that's going to do is draw the sprite as it is now you might think well it already does that but this is why it's important if you were to do draw underscore text x y hello so that's our text and then you were to run the game right now what would happen can you guess it will draw the text and not the player but maybe you want it to draw both maybe you're drawing a health bar above the player and you want it to draw both the player and the health bar well draw underscore self actually fixes that for us if we add it above this code draw underscore self then you know we hit play then you will notice that it will actually draw both the sprite and hello now I did I do have an animation from one of the previous tutorials which I have not actually gotten rid of yet so I apologize for that but I'm actually gonna deal with that right now let's just let's just no more no more so as you can see, draw underscore self has fixed this because it has drawn both the text and the player. Now, of course, you know if you're doing a health bar, you might want to draw the text more above the player. So we can add like a minus twenty, you know, like a minus five or something, and that will draw it above and center it a bit. And you can probably tell how helpful this will be. So if you're running to any form of errors when it comes to drawing and you're trying to solve them this is probably a really helpful piece of code for you so this has been a short episode of this you know tutorial series guys and i want to thank you guys so much for watching i have some really cool videos coming out some really cool ones and i hope you guys will enjoy them so anyways i will talk to you in the next tutorial